Wagwan, wagwan, wagwan. You know the day. I Jamaica TV. Viewers, subscribers, oh nah deal it. You know say Jamaica TV and we day back again with the next video. Yeah, and today we thought we come and talk about training about dancehall music. More often know what the people them think about the dancehall movement in a Trinidad right now with current state. Because honestly, me not really see nothing much I go on. But watch out, we'll come back and we're gonna talk about it. You hear that? Trinidad! Trinidad! As a fan of Trinidad dancehall music, me day I'm really a look around and Honestly, I feel disappointed. And I know it have whole heap of fans out there were disappointed also. Because enough of the artists them who we see that gun it last year. Plenty of the artists and them who was gunning it, bro. We ain't seen or hear nothing from them this year. Because as we all know, unfortunately we lose K-Lion and we lose Rebel 6 as it and them man there. I don't really care when nobody wants to stay, but them man there was the two front runners for Trinidad dancehall music. We actually a see it now where them did really a keep the pace in the movement, you see me? And ever since the man them drop is like it's like the man them the other artists them I don't know if them confidence broke or them still a mourn or what but things are not like where it used to be. Things ain't like where it used to be, right? Me and no. But I don't want nobody feel like say well I don't have respect for the other artists them because that are not the case. I rate every youth to take part in a dancehall music, both Trinidad and Jamaica, because guess what? It all away of poor people pitney where I try to do something for myself. And honestly, in my book still, I feel like competition vital. Competition essential. Competition needed in the music business, isn't it? Me? But it's like right now all of the man them give up. I can't all know I can't see through that. I can't understand it. I never really did like a year ago. I never did really I expect the movement to the kind of water down or reach to a standstill. In a such a short space of time, is it? And I know plenty of you have the same opinion, plenty of you share the same view. Drop it down below in the comment section and make we see it. No, I'm not going to say nobody out there ain't putting in the work and nobody ain't doing nothing and thing. Nah, I would have never said that, is it? But I feel like more needs to be done, some more interest need for sure in the thing. You understand? Because trust me, fans out here who actually want to hear music, who want to hear new music, not just a set of gimmicks and them kind of thing there, but music for enjoy themselves. And I can't even say as much as people can go out and party because we see the little zest them keep all over the place. Well, it might be illegal, but you see where it'll take place. So people out there need music for enjoy. Plus, I feel like right now at the right time for the artists them put in the groundwork and continue putting in the groundwork because guess what now? As much as locally it might seem like Trinidad dance all big, it can still get bigger, it can get better, you understand? Sponsors and them things they can reach in the thing. Corporate sponsors where we are talking about the real money and spend and them kind of thing there. All of them things they left to get involved in a Trinidad dance all music. So the man them fair put in the groundwork right now. Now is not the time for the artists and them to be getting comfortable and sitting down. Nah, put in the work. You understand when the place open up but make people call for come do some tours and them kind of thing. They have to think big out of the box with the thing to see them way. No fans going and comment and let me know well, ever since K Lion and Rebel 6 drop out, that is what really causes slowdown on the dancehall scene and thing. But at the end of the day, I respect the two youth them, I rate them to the ground, I can tell her that. But the artists them are actually alive and they here and able for voice, going on the studio and voice. Them need for the more. Make the youth them stay up in heaven and feel happy and them kind of thing there brother. And depending upon who you really talk to, a person might tell us well Trinidad dance all dead from ever since Rebel 6 and K-Lion dead. Yeah, I swear to the people. Alright, look at this. Remember now you know, normally in a Trinidad at this point in time in the year, when it reach October, November, December and them time is only soca music a year playing on the radio and thing. Everybody only listening to soca music. Now we get for find out that no carnival ain't going and take place next year. And so we don't hear no kind of soca music. But it's like all of the Trinidad artists, them, them, they on mute. Nobody not really let out no set of song. Well, I'm not even gonna say them not let out no song, but we don't hear no bangers. We don't hear no new bangers on the road. This time last year, it have people saying, well, Jamaican dancehall going down, it's Trinidad dancehall coming up, all kind of thing. You hardly used to hear Jamaican music I play up on the radio in a recent times but we see which part now skilly ben crocodile teeth around the place red right there so i don't mean, understand that trinidad have too much young artists in order for no set a hot song now and drop on the road and have a song from jamaica for come back now and have burn up the streets now at the end of the day still me a jamaican i kind of understand that say a skilly ben song really around the place because it's a big tune and from song bad we just have to say song bad you see me big up skilly ben but at the end of the day, we see which part Trinidad have them own set of talent. And we see which part the movement did I go on good. We see which part the movement did I go on good. So we don't expect to see the thing falter. 
I up alone we want to see the movement go. We want to see the man them put interest in the thing and send out music for we the fans enjoy ourselves. Yeah, because when me look on it and me hear the Prime Minister say, well, no carnival 2021, me I say, where? Jano, well, you them have the opportunity now to just send out a whole set of song and just, and just make the people them enjoy themselves, you know, because if no carnival ain't going to take place, that is the perfect opportunity. Because if no carnival not take place, we know for sure going and have this. And if you're going and have this, and it ain't going to have no set of soca music played because honestly, I'll know me in a year of soca music. And if it was me, regardless of the fact that Carnival I got keep yes or no, I would have still be putting out songs. You get what I say? Not because it wouldn't have any Carnival, I wouldn't put out songs and think, nah, you're mad. But that are how the man them choose to set their mind. That are the kind of mentality where them choose to have. I can't even bash them, you understand? But I find it have too much, too much, too much young youth in a Trinidad who was doing Trinidad dance or music. And it's like right now, the man them just get washed up. I don't know if it's the lack of competition or what, but the man them act like them wash up. The man them need to drop song, brother. I day I wonder what, where the next song them there, what, what happened? But viewers and subscribers, Leave all of the thoughts them down below in the comment section and make a whole of reasoning about it because honestly as a fan, I'm not impressed. The dog them need for the better. Let me know how to think though my people at Jamaica TV. Leave all of the thoughts them down in the comment section, isn't it? Yeah.